tell me again, who are you and why are you truly here? It is the truth. The primitive life forms on this planet are incapable of listening, which must result in what you call divorce. I suppose repeating myself wouldn't hurt anyone. Okay. But I only want you to repeat yourself if it's the truth. I have nothing to gain by lying. Your planet is in imminent danger. Those burning, lifeless corpses, they're calling you out. Who's they? Like I have mentioned before, the Zarmentagans. Uh, the, the Zarmen... Zarmentagans. Yes, the, thank you. Why? Why are they doing this? The fires and the murders? They're trying to see how you will retaliate with all your power. Why do this here? The Zarmentagans are a race hell-bent on conquering and destroying. They have sent a scout to perform a recon operation to your world to see if you pose any threat to their plans and efforts. The way these scouts do their recon is by causing fires, by committing mass murders, or by doing anything that will really upset the world leader. They will not stop until they have seen you at your strongest. Once this happens, they will send their entire fleet into your solar system and eradicate most life forms on this planet. Hmm, interesting. But what about you? Uh, you've told us all about these Zarman Tagans, but my people can't find anything about you. We're assuming that you're not from this planet either? Your men will find nothing of me on those computers. Hmm. Do not assume. I am not of this planet. I've come as an ally. An ally? Of the enemy? Yes, an ally. But to you. I come from the planet Restoria, who has all of its inhabitants taken oath to prevent the destruction of planets in the universe. Zarman Stop! It's all well and good, but we don't need your help putting out these fires to stop an arsonist. My people are very capable of defending themselves. Of course. These arsonists are more powerful and dangerous than anything you have ever seen. You earthlings possess no power to combat them. I am the exact opposite of the Zarmentagans. We can harm and kill them. Without our help, you will fall prey to their slavery. Um, if you are lucky. Okay, you know, we'll take what you're saying into very serious consideration. But... If what you are saying is true, then you pose just as much of a threat to us, and you will need to be detained. How unfortunate. Your planet and Sending I were unable to see right eye to eye. Unfortunately, I cannot allow myself to be detained. What? Farewell, Wilson. No! This planet is capable of harming him. Please, their strongest attack harms themselves. If there was an attack that could end me, we would have stayed. I'm not in favor of killing, but I will do our best. Ladies and gentlemen, we, the government of the world, hear you. Many of you believe that they've spotted aliens in recent months, but let us reassure you, this is not the case. What you think you witnessed, the extraterrestrial terrorists from above, was, in fact, from our very own planet. The burnt bodies, the fires, were set by a cabal of arsonists formed from around the world, band together, to watch the world burn. To put your minds at ease, we have found every member of this terrible organization and put them in the darkest hole imaginable. They won't light a match or even see the light again. Let this be a lesson to anyone else out there thinking of pulling a similar stunt. They thought they were safe. And they thought they could hide. But we smoked them out. And we will find you too. Good night, and may God bless America. <laughs>